part of SF City's vision is we have various initiatives that we're trying to move forward on in different issue areas, public safety, education, transportation, one of them is philanthropy. And we wanted to, instead of forwarding various credible projects or initiatives to our members, to try to focus them on one project that was making a real impact, there was never a portal for civ for civic engagement for the average everyday resident of San Francisco. Uh, it was this idea that government could solve this problem alone, which I think we all know is, is not possible. So Project Homeless Connect created this avenue for the public to get involved in solutions. So there are various ways. What makes it very exciting is that we use the community, the volunteers, and the resources of the community to help meet the needs of those experiencing homelessness here in our community. Through one day, using over a thousand volunteers, we can meet the needs of 2,000 people who are experiencing homelessness. Needs such as medical, haircuts, food, all of the things that could take months for someone to receive, we can do in one day by using, again, the community as a resource to meet the needs of the community it serves. We've been up and running for about you know, 14, 15 months as an organization and just recruited our 500th member, Neighborland, who is an online community organizing portal, um, very similar to trying to engage neighbors and neighborhoods around priorities and new solutions and felt that this was a perfect partnership um, to bring them into um, our goal to engage our members to give back and to get involved on in the issue of homelessness. So we've linked uh, Neighborland to our efforts with Project Homeless Connect to, you know, expand on Homeless Connect's uh, internal database. They have about 20,000 people that have participated in the program over the past seven, eight years. So what we're doing now is to expand that network to SF City's membership, and we represent almost 25,000 employees, and then tap into Neighborland's network as well, that we have these triangle of three organizations that are all seeking to organize and to get people engaged um, around this you know, priority issue for San Francisco.